Hello everyone, it's a pleasure this afternoon to tell you about this really fantastic picture by Hugh Sorey. Many of you may know Hugh Sorey because he's known as one of Australia's most famous outback painters. And one thing I absolutely love about Hugh Sorey is that even though many Australian artists have painted the bush as kind of a celebration of our nationalism and a patriotic thing, Hugh Sorey actually lived everything that we see depicted in his fabulous pictures. So he was actually born at Budrum, here where my art studio is, out near Forest Glen. His father was in the timber industry. And um, from there, he, he went into the army and later on, he and his mum um, got a soldier's settler's block and they apparently it was the most dreadful block. And Sorey really made no money at all in the early part of his life but then he was always dabbling and painting. And that then went on to become his career later in his life. But along the way, he would keep beautiful little pieces of paper in his saddlebag and draw little sketches. So in his mind, from having experienced this life in the outback, he had like an encyclopedic um, range of imagery that he could then depict in his really humorous and quite funny pictures. They, they can also be very dignified too. He does beautiful ones of men on horseback which show, you know, the sheep and cattle industry and they're amazing as well. But the one that I like to talk about today is this one here and it's called The Travelling Salesman. And here you can see him over here with his suitcase open with all his bits and bobs trying to sell um, his wares to the fellows in the local pub. And they're all looking a little bit funny and laconic. I'm not sure if they're really that interested but they're letting him have his spiel anyhow. And you can see here they've got a cigarette and a beer in hand and they're standing in the public bar. And if you've noticed in Australia when you go into a public bar how dark they are, you always get this lovely shaft of light coming in from outside, which I think is a really lovely observation of Hugh Sorey's. And funnily enough too, can you see the, um, the lady over here with the broom? Well, that's unusual because obviously in the days that Hugh Sorey was painting, women weren't allowed in the public bar. So here she is. She's allowed in this painting because she's sweeping up after everybody. And it's just great that he includes her as part of it. And you see a funny little thing here with the bra strap hanging off the shoulder. Just so truthful and so honest about what it was really like out there. And of course also paintings hanging in the bar. Now that's interesting because Hugh Sorey was known um, in outback circles for painting pictures in exchange for beers because he never seemed to have any money. So... That's how he used to pay his bar bill in kind by doing pictures. And Mary Barry's pub in Dolby is a famous example of that. There's a big painting there that everybody knows about. So really, here we are just showing what life is like in the outback. I love the sort of barrel-chested guys. They all seem to look like that. They're all a bit bandy-legged from riding horses. They're tall, strong, um, kind of got a laconic sense of humour. The, um, the barman who's seen it all, he's here in the background watching on. And uh, yeah, it's just a great um, picture and a really good example of Hugh Sorey's work. I hope you've enjoyed that little bit of fun about Hugh Sorey and this fantastic new oil that's just come into the studio. Thanks for listening.